Animal Kingdom is alive and celebrating 20 amazing years. The magic of nature, thrilling new worlds, and dazzling entertainment has delighted guests since opening day April 22nd, 1998. Ready to plan your Animal Kingdom adventure? How about some explorer tips from the mastermind himself? Hi, I'm Joe Rohde. I'm an Imagineer, a creative director, and I'm gonna tell you my top five places at Disney's Animal Kingdom. Number one, when you're in the queue line for Expedition Everest, and the big temple with the tears is coming behind you now in that little courtyard, when you stand there and look around, you could be in Nepal. There's nothing you can see that isn't like you're just right in the Himalayas. Number two, walking around the Tree of Life when you go up really close to the tree, you see stuff that nobody else sees. Armadillos, octopus, beetle, an owl. It's really, really cool. Number three, the Hippo River. There isn't another Hippo River in the United States of America. So when you come around that corner and you see this huge river with these hippos in it, that's a pretty special moment. Number four, you go through Flame Tree Barbecue. There's this beautiful reflecting pond it's inspired by all these places we used to stay in Bali, where all of our wood carvers lived. So we'd always stay in these exotic little places that always had a reflecting pond, and it's kind of a tribute. It's really a beautiful part of the pond. Number five, the ride flight of passage is an extraordinary emotional experience. The best ride I've ever been yeah. on in my life. <laughs> it felt like you're actually flying on a banshee. It's so much more immersive. Something is on with that ride. It's a very uplifting ride, and it is one of my favorite things in the park. I could do another five if I had the time, but start with those, and you'll find your own if you just look all around Disney's Animal Kingdom. We'll hear more from Joe Rohde later, but first, sure to become one of your favorites is our all-new show, Up! A Great Bird Adventure. Inside Disney Parks takes you behind the scenes as this show takes flight. The wilderness must be explored! Come on, come on! Roar. Guests will enjoy a new show at Disney's Animal Kingdom where we meet up with the characters Russell and Doug on their next great bird adventure. Working with Pixar has been such an incredible joy to bring that to life on the stage. I bring uh, Indian classical dance called Bharatanatyam from the south of India. It is a storytelling form to which we thread in through the movements of the lead actress. It has been a wonderful experience working behind the scenes with birds. They have their own personality. We use positive reinforcement, treats and rewards and things that they like, so we never make them do anything they don't want to do. They're just like actors. They have to learn their cues. They have to be able to make their moves. We truly are moving at their cycles for bringing their natural behavior into a story that is unfolding. It's a great bird adventure. Hello! We're here inside the Rookery of Wind Traders to give you a first look at a limited release banshee. This banshee was created to celebrate the first anniversary of Pandora, the world of Avatar. The colors were inspired by the bioluminescent landscape of Pandora at night. This banshee flies into the Rookery late May at Disney's Animal Kingdom. At the heart of Disney's Animal Kingdom is the story of nature and our connection to animals and the environment. Joe Rohde, one of the key forces behind this creation, believes that mission still holds true today. Animal Kingdom emerged from a whole bunch of concepts. There were many theories of different kinds of lands that might be able to evoke this idea of an animal kingdom. The core of this park revolves around these animals. To be as authentic, unrehearsed, and spontaneous, this was a fundamental divergence in how to think about a park. So the story is about you and what you are gonna see and what you're gonna encounter on this day in these amazing places. Very little of this park is by my hand. The park is the result of the work of so many talented people brought together in this unexpected team to deliver this unexpected project. It's kind of amazing to think that it is the 20th anniversary. I've watched it evolve from its opening day to now. That's really quite an accomplishment. That's a wrap for this celebration, but the fun is just getting started. Walt Disney World Resort is about to heat up your vacation with one incredible summer. Check out Disney Parks blog to stay up to date on all the coming attractions and special entertainment. We'll see you next time on Inside Disney Parks.